for breakfast, I'll be having some granola. I made this yesterday. It's just some homemade one with various nuts and coconut chips and dates and stuff. So that one's really nice and healthy as well. It's like no added sugars and everything like the ones you get from um, the grocery store. I've also got some strawberries and I've got some organic Greek yogurt. So I'm just gonna put it into a bowl and we're gonna mix it together. And there we are. It's so quick and easy once we've already made the granola, like beforehand. So you just have to put like three different ingredients in and then it's really quick in the mornings if you're in a rush. I've already filled the saucepan with hot water. I'm just gonna put it on the flame now. I'm just gonna take some white vinegar and just pour a little bit in there. Okay, so I'm gonna show you a really cool trick now. So we're gonna get some cling wrap and then you put it in a bowl. So just like carve it out through the bowl and then we're gonna crack an egg in it and then I'll show you what we do. So there I have, I've cracked the egg. I'm just gonna wrap it up so it's nice and tight like that. And then once the boil, the water boils, I'll show you what we do next. Okay, that's started to boil, so we're just gonna drop it into the pot and then leave it there. And then once it's cooked, you'll be able to tell. Then we'll just pull it out, it makes it so much easier. So that is both in now and the other one's already started to cook. You can tell it's getting a bit wider. And the vinegar really helps make the texture and um, fluffiness of the actual poached egg. So while the um, eggs are cooking, we're just gonna take half a cup of pineapple. So that's the pineapple pieces I'm using. I'm gonna take a cup of spinach and put that in there also. Then we've got a quarter of lemon juice and a kiwi fruit and I'll pop that in there too. And then I've got some toast and I'm just gonna put the avocado and spread it on top of it now. There's our perfect avocado now. Look how yum that looks and fresh. Just gonna spread that all over the top now. Now with the egg like that, we're just gonna unravel the glad wrap and just take the egg out. There we go. The eggs are actually a bit overcooked. Normally I like the yolk a bit more runny, but they're still a bit runny inside. It's just kind of more cooked than I'd like it though. And now we're just gonna get some of this pink salt and then just sprinkle a bit on top. And there we have the delicious poached eggs. Now just for the juice, grabbing a handful of ice, so about six blocks, and just putting those in, and then just a cup of water. And now we're just gonna blend that all together. Now just pouring it into a glass. And there we go. We've got the green juice and a smashed avocado with eggs. So here I've got the turkey mince and one onion here sauteing there, one brown onion, and then just the spelt pasta here, just cooking as well. Now for the sauce, so it's gonna be a green sauce, so you just um two tomatoes cut up and then we've got corn. 200 grams of corn, five tablespoons of olive oil. Um, two garlic cloves here, so I'll just be using the ones that have already like, like the paste version. So I'll just use two um, tablespoons of that. And then we've got some basil, so half a tablespoon of basil. And then just some spinach as well. And then just some rosemary as well, half a tablespoon. Now I'm just gonna be blending that together. And just pouring it now into the meat. Now just put all the sauce in and mix it through and then ready to drain the pasta and mix it through. And there we go, mixed all through. And then just sprinkling some cheese on top. 